know we're getting better and better each and every day. So we just go back out to practice, look at the film, and see what we can correct, and then go at it next practice. Anybody impressed today? Offense, defense? Um, offense, you know some of the young players. Tate Martell, he had a good day. Um, you know, our first team defense, Worley, Book, they all had good days. And we just trying to get better and better each day. So. What does Tate Martell do well? You know, he's definitely a run threat, so, you know, we do the uh, the option. You know, he's real good at that, so. And he's real shippy. He can't really tackle him just open space, so, you know, he's going to be real good. He so he's not get something done every time he goes in there, Damon. I mean, he, I mean, even in the spring, he seems to get something done when he goes in there, right? I mean, yeah, he's definitely a playmaker. You can't deny that. He's definitely a playmaker. Uh, he wasn't wearing the jersey. Does anybody get a good hit on him? Uh, nobody, Welcome that's what to I'm college saying. football? Yes. Oh, nobody got a good hit on this play. How'd the other two look? Who? Uh, Dwayne and, and uh, Joe. Oh, yeah, you know Dwayne and Joe, they always look good. So, you know, they go out each and every day. They make spectacular plays, too, so, you know, them. Damon, how much does this secondary need you? Because every the other starter's gone. How, how would you describe how important you are to this group? Uh, I think I'm very important, you know. You know so last year they set the standard, I mean, the years before. But uh, it's definitely up to me to be a leader, to show them what it is to be, you know, we call ourselves BIA, so there's no drop off or no lagging off, so it's definitely up to me to like, set the standard and keep the tradition going. Coach Young says you've done that too. I mean, I mean, he was really impressed by your spring, he's been impressed by your first practices now. Is, is, uh, what comes over a guy when he knows he's got to be the leader? You understand what I'm saying, Damon? I mean, what, yeah. what did you know you had to step up, I guess, in that regard? It's just knowing that you got to take on a responsibility, you know, as younger guys looking up to you. So everything you do, they're watching. So it's like the spotlight's on you to make the right decision and, you know, to come out to practice. When they see you not doing right, they not going to do right. If you're doing, keeping up, having enthusiasm, they're going to have enthusiasm. So. It's just up to me going out each and every day, knowing that I got people looking up to me. And I got to bring the juice every day. Hey, man, what's, that, what's Eric been like since, since his injury and now that he's back here and he's waiting for a spot? Have you noticed any difference in him since he's done it? Yeah, Eric, he's been having a good uh, first couple practices. You know, he's been in the Jordan, running with the ones, and he's in the Jordan running with the ones. So he's been having some good practices. What, is, what does Eric bring? Like, what, he's never really got to see a play other than some special team stuff. So how would you describe him as a safety? Physical. Very, very physical. He's a great tackle. So that's what Eric brings to the table. He get the guy on the ground. Is either one of those guys similar at all to Malik? Would you describe? I mean, you know what I mean, the Malik's ability to play a win, window washer out there at the backside sometimes. And... Um, yeah, they both have great, good range. So and they both good tacklers like Malik also. So there's definitely some similarities. Did, did you pick up anything from just watching Malik yourself? I mean. Uh, <laughs> That you now have in your game you didn't have a year ago. You know what I mean, Dave? I mean, where's your game definitely gotten better? Yeah, it's definitely gotten better, like, I believe, being that deep middle safety. So, just looking at him and, you know, he set the standard for us last year. Like I said, there's no laggage or sagging off. So, you know, it was up to us to, we got to raise the bar. You know, you guys have a lot of freshmen who just came in highly rated. And a lot of people already know who they are. What are you are any of those guys standing out, and what is your take on just how advanced a guy like Sean Wade or Jeff Okuda is in comparison to that you came in kind of the same way? Are they more advanced than you might have been at the time? Or what's your take on how they play the game? Yeah, I would definitely say they're more advanced, more physical. Um, they pick up the playbook a lot faster, and yeah, they're going to develop real good. So they out here looking good. Isaiah Print, I mean, uh, Isaiah Pryor, my boy, he's looking real good too. He's very physical, and you know. Like I said, BIA every year is going to set the standard and we'll keep going and going. There's not going to be no lagging. Does Kendall, does Kendall Sheffield? Yeah. Best in America. Does Kendall Sheffield look like a guy who's been around for a while? I mean, what's what's yeah. your take on him? Yeah, it's like Kendall Sheffield came on the team. You would think he was already been with us for years. Like, you know, he's very fast, one of the best athletes I've ever seen. So he's a great addition to the team. I love having him. I think a lot of people just kind of assume that he's going to be a shutdown corner for you guys. And I know you just mentioned you think he's. How can somebody come in, you know, off of a junior college year and adapt so quickly? I mean, we've heard nothing but good things about him. That's just a test to the person he is. He loves competition. He 
could tell when if he gets beat in one on ones or in the practice, you can see it in his face that that it doesn't sit right with him. So um, you got Denzel and Damon Arnett right next to him. So you know they're definitely pride in it. He, he definitely has pride in himself and he wants to live up to the standard, like I said. Two more questions. You mentioned yeah. setting the standard a couple times, and other guys have said that as well. No matter the position, is the standard at Ohio State to set a new standard every year? And so, I mean, the standard keeps raising, but, um, you know, it's just a deny your man the ball. Don't let be the best back in the country, number one. I mean, do you, do you want guys to say that about you next year, like you did about the league, that you set the standard this season? Yeah, definitely I would look forward to uh, people saying that. We yeah. talked to the wide receivers this week, and they were raving about the deep ball. I mean, you're back there, you see it. it are, is this a different team this year when it comes to that ability? I mean, yeah, they're definitely taking a lot of shots and a lot of 50-50 balls and receivers are coming down with some of them, so that's definitely great to see. Who of those guys, yeah, who of those guys have caught your eye? I mean, that's stepped up his game. Terry McLaurin. Yeah. Terry, he's been having a great ball, ball cap. But he can't not drop the ball. Like, he's catching everything. Um, Benjamin Victor. Uh, Harris Campbell. Austin Mack, they all have a yeah. Yeah, both the floor. Co Coach Yano said, yeah. Yeah. Well, obviously you played last year. What did you really want to work on this year? Uh, I, I felt like I played good last year. Uh, I just want to work on some of the routes that we played in different coverages and adjusting to them. Uh, I felt like I played good. Uh, I definitely get worked on a lot this spring and this fall. So. Coach Yano said that one of the emphasis this year was cut down on the 25 plus yard plays. I mean, I'm sure he's probably talking to you guys about that, but do you agree? I mean, that that is one of the things where y'all could get better. Uh, yeah. if there's, you know, because y'all were pretty pretty good last year defensively. Yeah, we should get yeah. better at the 25 plus plays, and that falls on the safeties to get the person down on the ground too. So. Great, Damon. Thank Thanks you very much. much.